is a UFC featherweight division fight. Let's get this one started here. Round one is underway. And we've got a striker who is a force to be reckoned with. Tonight, though, he draws a guy who can do a little bit of everything. And that guy is usually the one that will have the advantage. But we know what a high-level striker is. And this guy is as high-level as we've ever seen in the UFC. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Rock'em, suck him out of the shoot here. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Ball left hook to the head, it's blocked. I mean, he's cutting him down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Left hand is true, that will absolutely work. He throws it like a piston, back and forth. He's landing that beautiful left hand. Under a minute to go. Planted and fired there, landed to the body. Seconds to go in this one. Look at him whip his hip into that. Oh, that is as big a strike as he has landed thus far tonight. Big, massive shot lands. Look at how tough his opponent is, though. Still standing, still in their fight. What an end to round one. All right, so a huge round for him there. Nearly had him out of there with the head kick. Did get the knockdown. Talk us through the replay. He got the knockdown. He won the round. He did everything correct. The only thing he didn't do is finish the fight. But if he continues down the path, if he continues to do the exact same thing as he did before, he will get that finish. Round two underway. Ooh, big shot lands. Very nice leg kick there by Lee. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also gonna be able to land. He's gotta be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Look at him working and trying to shut the liver down. Just out of range with that strike. Right hand landed. Oh, combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. And every one of them are landing. He's overwhelming him with different attacks. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Ten seconds to go in the round. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. And that's the end of round number two. The volume is weighing a little bit. All right, now we take a look back at some of the action in that previous round, DC. A lot to like on both sides, really. I mean, both were intent on going forward. And what happens when nobody wants to take a step back? They meet in the middle. That's exactly what they did 
and they both found success over the course of that round. All right, DC, here we go with our next round, and we'll see if he can pick up where he left off. High volume of strikes landed in the previous round. High volume of strikes landed. He was able to be accurate, but also very, very active in his approach to the start of this fight. Came oh, home. a huge strike lands there, DC. He landed that massive shot. Now he needs to try to find the next shot, the follow-up shot, that will finish the fight. Oh, lands another beautiful strike to the body, really starting to connect at will when it comes to work in the body, and especially effective doing it later in this fight. Didn't see a lot of that from him in the earlier rounds. Good fight here, under two to go. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Big roundhouse now, just misses. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Nice strike. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Unable to land with that punch. There's no tell on that leg kick. Oh, and now he lands the knee. I'm not sure his opponent saw that coming. He didn't see it coming because he does such a great job of just throwing. He doesn't have any tell when he's going to throw a knee. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. We had a knockdown there, but not a knockout. No, it wasn't a knockout, but you can't take those shots. That big punch landed, and it sat him down. If he gets hit with another one of those, it might be good night, Irene. Three minutes remain in round four. Oh, big head kick there. Oh. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect, so fast, so accurate. And watch the ability to land anywhere. Just over two minutes to go. Nice straight right, Lance. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. So there it is, taller fighter landing a knee to the body. Takedown defense holds up. Time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got a very bad head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Fourth round here, less than a minute to go. Oh, single collar tie here. He's just out of range with the big right hand. Nice punch by Lee. seconds left. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Caught the kick. Buzzer sounds for the end of round four. 20 minutes in the books. All right, so a high-level round there for him. We'll show you some of the action here, and you got to think the knockdown is going to be featured prominently here. Thought he might have had him out of there. He thought he had him, but the guy's tough. The guy's durable. He has a fantastic chin, but he just needs to stay the course. He does not need to be discouraged. Think about this. You're winning. You're winning going away. That was just a moment. 
keep going in the same direction, and you will get the finish that you want so bad. We have arrived at this fifth and final round. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, nice. Lee's got a big bruise starting to form on the right side of his body. Two minutes now to go in this one. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Kick to the body now. That one won't land. Right hook coming, it's blocked. Well, there's a takedown attempt. No surprise that he would go for it there, but unable to get the fight to the ground. Whenever your opponent knows that you're gonna try to take him down, you have to disguise it. He did not disguise it. He tried to just shoot a blind shot and got defended as you would expect it to. He's going after the head. Oh, big elbow. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Ooh, looking to set up that head kick. Final seconds of the fight. What else can you say but what a fight? All right, so the fight goes the distance. Both guys had their moments, but there was a striking advantage, albeit slight, and perhaps that'll be enough for him to get his hand raised tonight. It should be enough. I mean, when you watch the fight, you understand that you are watching two of the best mixed martial artists in the world. But it did look like he did just enough to earn a competitive decision. decision.